A story is told of our chief Monze Mugulu of the Tonga speaking people chose a cob of maize over a gun during the colonial rule, signifying his desire for peace over conflict. Many, many years later, the chiefdom through Rwindi Gonde ceremony he is still preaching the message of peace. I want to thank my colleagues, the Royal Highnesses, all those who have come, because what we are looking for is peace. Despite the poor farming season, due to prolonged dry spells in the last rain season, gratitude is a must. What is important is to allow our head of state to work for us. We know he's working extremely hard to ensure that no one goes to bed without food. The arena came to a standstill and then rode in euphoria when long-time patron of the ceremony, President of Zambia, Hagaende Hijilema, made his grand entrance. So we are working very hard to dam the waters, to create weirs, to basically harvest the water so we can irrigate and produce food, not the rain season only, but 12 months a year, throughout the years. That is our preparation and also to increase our storage capacity. That's what we are working on as a government. So we are ready, we should be ready going forward. So your government is getting ready to distribute fertilizer for this coming season. Please plant early. We'll make sure the meteorological department provides the information, correct information, so that farmers can produce more. Mr. Hijire Mahas called for peace and unity. So I ask all the traditional leaders that let's work together. This is your government. Pol political leaders, there is time that we argue about politics. In the case of drought, all of us must work together. Traditional leaders, church leaders, political leaders, government, everybody, we must work together to alleviate the suffering that our people are going through. The president has been accompanied by a number of ministers at the ceremony. Mr. President, the people here and the people of Zambia are very proud of the achievements you have so far achieved on behalf of the people of Zambia. We encourage that we celebrate our diversity, our unity, and our shared humanity as we embrace our traditions and customs which makes us who we are today. The 2024 Windy Gonde ceremony has been attended by thousands of spectators and business people. Mombeha Mobola, NBC News, Monze.